Hey Wolfpack, Cameron here from Wolfstorm Off-Road. Today we're going to be working with this 2020 Jeep Gladiator GT and installing our brand new aggressive utility style rear fender flares. I'll be walking you through removing the OEM liner and fender, then leading you through your installation of your new rear fender flares. For this install, we're going to recommend the help of a friend, as you will need someone to help hold the fender in place as you fit to your Jeep. Let's get started. Step 1. Removing the OEM inner liner. Locate the six black tension clips inside the wheel well that's securing the rear fender liner. To remove, grab a wedge tool. Clip pliers or fastener remover work well. With a bit of pressure, they should pop out. Next, we're going to locate the three screws supporting the back of the liner. Using an 8mm bit, remove the screws. An electric drill definitely speeds up the install process. We now need to locate the nine outer support clips that are securing the liner to the fenders. Simply separate by pulling the liner from the fender with some pressure. These clips are a one-time use, so you won't need to worry about reusing them. Our next step is removing the OEM fender. To start, you'll have to locate the 15 white tension clips that are supporting the OEM fender to the vehicle. If you're planning to keep the OEM fender, you'll want to take your time on this step. With a pair of needle nose pliers, Crimp the back of the clips to release from the support holes. If you're not worried about keeping the OEM fender, pulling with some force should free the fender from the body. Now we're ready to install your new Wolfstorm rear fender flares. Make sure you have your socket wrench with a 316 Allen key bit and a 13 millimeter wrench. Go ahead and locate the mounting holes for the fender. Next, let's mount the fender. Make sure to have an extra hand for this part. One person should hold the fender in place while the other hand tightens the screws and nuts. Once the fender is in place, start securing with your tools. A drill might be a bit too large in these small spaces. Nice work. Now just follow these same steps for the opposite fender. Now before taking to the trail, we highly recommend installing an inner liner for optimum protection. Congrats on your new rear fender flares from Wolfstorm Off-Road. With their ultra rugged design, your Gladiator will tackle the many trails ahead. If you like this step-by-step -step video, be sure to like and subscribe if you'd like to be notified of any future new Wolfstorm products and videos. Thanks for stopping by here at Wolfstorm Off-Road. Keep it wild, Wolfpack. We'll see you next time.